So I've mentioned this before in regards to motion tracking and stuff like that, but if you're rendering in DaVinci Resolve or DaVinci Resolve Studio and you find that it's taking an absolutely unrealistic, weirdly long amount of time when previously it wasn't going to take that long, you might have a graphics driver issue. So what you got to do is stop the job, close the program, cancel renders and quit, save your project, wait for that to actually happen, this time it didn't take so long. Then we're going to go on the keyboard and push control, windows key, let's see if I can do it with one hand, well, control, windows key, shift, B. That resets the graphics card driver. Now, our graphics card is closed. Make sure that Resolve is gone. Resolve is no longer open. Now we're going to reopen Resolve. Wait for it to load up here. Loading, 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 loading. Hey, by the way, if this helps you, be sure to click the like button and maybe subscribe if you're interested. I make lots of weird and random and cool videos. So we're going to update our job. Add to render queue. Replace. Remove the other job. And click render all. Now... Our ETA is three hours, four hours, instead of nine hours. So yeah. Two hours. One hour and 59 minutes. It just a minute ago, it said nine hours. So this is going to drastically reduce the render time. Just uh, some weird stuff happens with the graphics drivers sometimes. This is with an NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1650, arguably not the best of graphics cards for rendering 4K HDR main 10 video, but yeah. I'm going to save a huge amount of time. Instead of taking a whole day to render, it's going to only take a couple hours. Anyway, be sure to click the like button if this helped you, and cheers! Thanks for watching.